Welcome everybody to Spinner Rack Review. Today we're talking about Doctor Strange Best Defense number one. This is part of that five issue Defender series. You bring together all the top um, original Defenders Doctor Strange, Silver Surfer, Hulk, Namor. They're coming all together in one comic. And all these comics are trying to bring them together. Not sure exactly how. We're still trying to figure that out. But hey, let's start with Doctor Strange and figure out what's going on here. But we find Doctor Strange in this desolate world. It's just been destroyed, overrun. Um, we don't know what's going on. He's by himself, or kind of, because there's something in his bag that's talking to him. We don't know what it is. What we do see him do is that he's running out of power. He's running out of strength. And so he needs to um, um, have magic for his, the eye of Agamemnon. And so what he does is that he pulls out an eye from his own his freaking eye. And he puts it in his um, the amulet, and um, to to power it. And so, it is um, how he finally has his last bit of power. So whatever's been going on has been going on for quite some time. I mean, it, it's a, it's been a plan that he's had in motion for many years or decades. Um, we're not one hundred percent sure yet, but it's cost him everything from his relationship with Clea to almost everybody in the human world. But this plan is, is pretty insidious because he's decided that the only way, the only option he has to destroy Dormammu and his minions from ravaging the earth is to do this. I mean, this is a last ditch. It kind of reminds me of what happened in Infinity War where he says, oh, there's only one choice out of millions, you know. And, um, of course, he doesn't explain it, but he's going through it. I, I'm kind of a little turned back with this kind of stuff because I'm like, hey, why don't you just try something, be explicit, tell people what's going on. Do millions have to die for you? But or billions, but hey, this is his only chance. So um, he realizes Dormammu is going to come at the very end to come and get him by himself because he finally figured Doctor Strange is totally beaten. But lo and behold, Doctor Strange has a surprise. In the bag is the Hulk, the head of the Hulk. And he's been magically imbued to reflect or to absorb Dormammu's power. And in Dorm absorbing Dormammu's power, he kills him and he takes... he. I guess, gets shot into another dimension or another world, which is our own. And here is where he crash lands. And what does this scene over here remind you of? Ah, oh, it reminds you of where the Hulk started from. Best defense number one. So they're trying to relate everything back to one another once again. And I think it did a decent job. Not a great job, but it did a decent job. And of course, we're still asking a million questions, um, especially with the next episode coming up. We're like, yo, what is happening? You know, is Defenders going to be the thing? So I'll try to get that one out to you as soon as possible. But I'm hoping that, you know, this catches on a little bit more on fire than what we've been seeing. Spin Rack, out.